Hey guys, it's MCLAPD Awesome here, and um, I would like to talk to you about um, restarting the car show. Now, if you are following our blog and our Twitter, you will realize that I posted information about that before this video even comes out. So, now that we're on the Tumblr blog, we do not need our channel anymore. Now, restarting the car show, I'm going to do it a little bit differently this time. Instead of using video footage that I record of you guys using your cars, what I'm going to do is have you guys take in-game pictures. Okay, in-game pictures. Upload them to your Rockstar Social Club account. Then save one of one picture that you're the one picture you're going to send me as your um, car photo that you want to enter. Save it to your computer. Then go to your email attach that picture to an email and send it to me now that may sound easy but it's actually a lot more complicated than it sounds I'm going to be doing a tutorial right now to explain a little bit more in depth now before I get to that the car show after, besides the video footage becoming pictures everything else is going to be the same you guys are still going to have to vote in order for me to decide a winner. You have to vote. You decide the winner. I put it in the next video. Um, so there you go. If you want more information, read the blog here. But I'm going to start the tutorial. Now, the first thing you're going to need are two things. Rockstar, a Rockstar Social Club account and an email. Now, you don't have to use Yahoo. You can use any email service provider like Gmail, Hotmail, Yahoo, whatever you can even use you know Verizon or Charter I don't even know what they have now but it doesn't have to be an online email service provider whatever you use to send emails will work fine now let's get to the first part you need to have a Rockstar Social Club account so you can sign up this will be your username your email your password confirm your password put in a birthday and a country now since I already have many accounts I'm not going to sign up but instead, I'm going to sign in to one of my many accounts. Excellent. It actually worked the first time. Okay. <laughs> um, now, what you want to do is link your accounts. Now, this is an account I have for my PC games. But I'm going to link it to one of my PlayStation accounts. So you're going to head over to Profile. Now, under here, you want to go to Account Linking. Click on that. Now, um, as you can see, I have Games for Windows Live, and my username is there. But um, what we want to do is add a PlayStation Network ID, or even this time, you can be on Xbox, you Xbox users, you can be on Xbox and send me your pictures as well, so it gives everybody an advantage. So we're going to add my PlayStation Network ID. Now, this is one I use, I haven't used in quite some time, I don't even think I know the email to it. So instead, I will not show you how to link your account. But you do, you'll put your sign-in information for the PlayStation, like whatever your email is to sign into the PlayStation, that's what you'll use. And then you'll type in the password that you used to sign in. You'll click sign in, and then, boom, you'll see a name right here. Or right here. Or I guess right here. I don't think that'll work, though. <laughs> for what we want to do. So now I'm going to show you how to get your pictures. Um, so we're going to sign out of this one and we're actually going to sign into the one I have linked. Hey guys, sorry, I had to figure out what my login was for my um, PlayStation one. Now that we're back. Okay, so I'm logged in. And um, now what we want to do is access our Midnight Club files that are our pictures that are saved on Social Club. However, you will notice here that if you go to account linking, I need to reconnect to the PlayStation Network. Anytime you change friend data or they change your data or if they delete you or whatever, it, it gets screwed up and you have to reconnect. So what we're going to do is reconnect. This means I have to sign in. Okay guys, sorry about that. Okay, so after you um, relink your account, you'll have to go up here and reload the page in order for it to register that you've relinked it. Now, as you can see down here, after you link your account and reload the page, it should show you what games you have linked. So what we're going to do to access your pictures file is go down here to games, click on Midnight Club. 
and then go over to gallery okay so it'll slowly load up your gallery and it's in no particular order these pictures can be switched around every time so what you're going to do is say I want this picture we're going to click view HD it'll open up a new tab now here's the tricky part and this wasn't included in the blog instructions because I didn't know about this the image will be saved as a dot ASHX I have not a clue what that is so what you're going to do is first thing click on this drop down menu you should have the option for all files save it as that now what you're going to do here is just put a title in so I'm just going to put temp but what you need to do is put dot jpg this is mandatory dot jpg otherwise I cannot open your picture file and it'll just get ignored because I cannot open the dot as hx file so you have to put dot jpg that's jpeg that will ensure that I can open it so put whatever title then dot jpg so we're going to save it it will download the file and um, it's on my desktop so let's show the desktop um, refresh it okay so then I can open the file now that that's done the fun part comes. We don't need this anymore, and we don't need this anymore. Okay, so I'm in my Yahoo. So I'm going to sign in, and we're on the MCLA Police Dept One. So I'll just sign into that. Okay, so of course we have mail messages. That doesn't surprise me. And I haven't been checking the email lately, as you could probably notice. Um, <laughs> so we're going to go um, create a message. Okay. So first thing is you're going to send it to MCLA Police Dept at Yahoo.com. Just ignore this. Okay. Just MCLA Police Dept at Yahoo.com. The subject is going to be car show entry. Okay. Then some email servers or provider um, require you to have a message so if you have a message just say hello or something just put something in there to keep it there now what you need to do is if you're using Yahoo there'll be an attach button here all email providers will have an attach button somewhere but it's right here for Yahoo now with Yahoo you have this annoying tool that you have to download to attach files it's a pain in the Oh boy, I can't believe I just said that. Okay. So now what I get to do is uh, run the application. Okay, so now that it's complete, let's attach the files. Now it's temp.jpg. Select. And it'll upload the file. It should be a fairly small file. Now then, this is the one image you're going to send me. And you're going to um, actually... If you have the option to get the full image, I didn't know you had this, but photo size, make it so it gives me the full image because I want the most HD I can get if you want to see an HD video. Okay, so we're all good here. We're going to send it. So it's going to send the message and whatever. Let's just accept that. Okay, so now we should have a new email. Reload the page. Yes. We do have a new email. Oh, I didn't know it said that. Okay. So it will load the message. And let's get this down out of here. And then I can download the image straight onto my computer and use it into, um, well, it'll just put it there. <laughs> Hey guys, thank you for watching this video, and I hope this information helped. Now you'll be able to send in photos to me for car shows, and this is good for more than just photos for me. This is good for you, and you could figure out ways that it'll benefit you. Anyway, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope it helped, and this is MCLAPD Awesome.
out.